welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be explaining that how to clean install windows 11 2 3 h2 now windows 11 2 3 h2 is officially released starting october 31st of 2023 and performing a clean installation with a usb flash drive is among the best method to upgrade it however microsoft recommend using an in-place upgrade through windows update but modifying the current installation can sometimes cause problem and unexpected error due to the compatibility issues. So this is the reason we recommend you that you should go and clean install Windows 11 2.3 H2 for the better upgrade. So let's quickly get started and see that how you have to clean install. So as of now you can see that if I type on my Windows search win vr and right now you can see that I have the 2.2 H2 version. This is what I will be upgrading by using a clean installation. So what you will have to do, bring up any of your favorite browser. Then type Windows 11.2.3 H2 ISO download. You will be getting the first link of Microsoft. Click on it. And then here you will come to the Windows 11 ISO download page. I will also leave the direct link in the description so that you can directly come to this page. Now once you come up here, scroll down and here you will find download Windows 11 disk image. So you will have to click on the drop down, choose Windows 11 multi edition ISO, click on download. From the drop down, choose your desired language, click on confirm, click here 64 download again and the downloading will be started. So it's around 6.2 gigabytes, so it will take some time and you can clearly see here that it says Windows 11 2.3 H2. So you will have to wait here until it's all been downloaded and once it's been downloaded you will have to connect any of your usb that you want to make bootable windows 11 usb so right now i have connected my kingston usb that is around uh, 60 gigabyte and after connecting it again open up your browser type rufus and you will be getting the first link click on it then scroll down a bit you will find the rufus 4.3.exe so click on it, download it and once downloaded and installed, you will be getting this kind of Rufus page will now be coming up. Now here in the very top in the device section, it will automatically detect your pen drive or USB drive that you want to make bootable. So make sure that the right one has been selected. Then in the boot selection, click on select and then you have to navigate to the location where you have downloaded the Windows 11 2.3 H2. So this is the one that we just downloaded. So select it, click on open. Now here in the volume label, select all and type win 11 2, 3, H2 so that you can quickly identify it. And once it's been done, finally you have to click on start. So now here you get some kind of recommendation in case if you want to make this bootable USB so that you can install Windows 11 on any kind of low hardware or unsupported hardware. Then you can keep this option check, which will be bypassing the secure boot and the TPM check. And here in the create a local account with username, you can type your desired username and then you have to click on OK. It will be deleting all the data. So just make sure that you don't have any kind of your data in the pen drive or in the USB drive. So click on OK. The process will now be started. So you will have to wait here until it's all been done. And then finally you will have a Windows 11 2.3 H2 bootable USB. Okay, so finally the process has been completed. Now it may take about 15 to 20 minutes. So you will have to keep some patience until it's all been done. So once it's been done, we have the final ready Windows 11 2.3 H2 bootable USB. So let me quickly restart my computer in the BIOS mode. And there can be different kind of BIOS key like F2, F10, delete, escape, depending on your manufacturer. Okay, so just use the BIOS key, enter the BIOS mode. Okay, so I'm using a virtual machine, but on your end, you have to change the boot sequence, boot priority order. So here I will choose USB device, hit the enter key. And this time the computer will be coming up with the installation of Windows 11. So finally the Windows setup is up. You have to click on next. Click on install now. Now here if you know your product key then you can enter it or simply click I don't have a product key it will automatically detect it. Choose the addition. I will go with Windows 11 Pro. Select it. Click on next. Check the agreement box then click on next. 
click on custom so now this is the most important part what you will have to do here you have to select the partition where your windows 11 was being installed and if you want that there should be your windows 11 old file so that you can take the data backup so you can just select it and click on next you don't have to delete or format but if you want to delete the old windows then you can select it then click on delete and the unallocated space will be created again you have to select it click on new click on apply again select it click on next and the installation will now be started so now let's wait here until all the installation process has been completed then i will finally show you that how it looks like and how we upgrade it to windows 11 2 3 h2 all right so finally we can see that the windows installation has been completed and we have the 2 3 h2 windows 11 now and if i show you this time if i search for winver so here it is so here it is you can see it says version 2 3 h2 of windows 11 and even you will find many changes here if you go to the settings so you will find a new home page on your windows 11 that looks really cool with all kind of other features so that's all guys for today that was the quick and the best method to clean install windows 11 2 3 h2 and it's the best way to upgrade your windows 11 and that's all guys for today hopefully you enjoyed this video and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next session Bye bye